Ghana's number one casino game. Aviata Alandio Betway Airport. Betway for the love of the game. Ghana's number one casino game. Aviata Alandio Betway Airport. Betway for the love of the game. Bet the responsible way. Regulated by the Gaming Commission of Ghana. No under 80. Terms and conditions apply. I was here. My name is Mubi Dun Komo. My name is Zai Felix. Sally. Sally, my name is Dun Komo. Sally Man. And I'm here. My name is Bono. Oh, sister. Good evening. Good evening. Now, I'm here. So, I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. What you are here? Because I'm here. Because I'm Let's talk about PC. Yeah. Um, we all know, I mean, last week, since May 2023, VJMS, she didn't win Artist of the Year. Like, yeah. before events, you know, were you, were, were you optimistic? Of course, of course. Me, I'm not really a, a gospel person, so you know me. But for this particular year, I felt that she worked. I mean, in my opinion, I think the only thing that Blacko beat her to is the fact that Blacko released an album. That's the only thing. That's the only thing that Blacko actually used in beating her. But I think she stood the chance. She had her own shows, Kumase, executive launch, and then a main show here in, 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 in Accra. So I felt she deserved it. It was a 50-50 chance. And mind you, every single person that was nominated to also deserved the chance. It wasn't an outsider that they brought to win. It was the people that in the same category with her that won. But I thought... You know, I felt that you should have won. Yes. I was here, I mean, winning. Hey, <laughs> but the PS, uh, you know, PS, uh, 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 so. No, but you know, you know, you know, you know, and you know, you know, you know, you you know, you know, you know, People are saying, I mean, how, how do you expect to win Artist of the Year with just a song? Yeah, that's why I'm saying that the only thing that Black Hole beat her to it was a, was a single. But the definition of the Artist of the Year does not even warrant that you should, it's either a single or an album. So she stood a chance, but I'm sure, say, the board had 40%, and the board and the academy also, in their own wisdom, also saw how Black also worked to release an album, a 14-track album. So I think they all deserve to, to, to have been there, and one of them won, so. 20 years in the game, I'm sure you followed yes, her. I, I mean, how have you seen her ministry? Um, I think one thing that has really made me like her is her humility. She's one of the most humble human beings I've ever come across. With all the fame and everything that she's gotten, she's so down to earth. You speak to her any time that I reach out to her, she will respond. Somebody of her caliber, I'm sure now at Gospel Artist of the Year, uh, Gospel Song of the Year, with all the attention that she got during the process, she wouldn't have even minded us for anything. But I, I, I think where she's coming from, being from a gospel background, has really taught her to be very humble. And I've seen growth. I've seen a woman with a lot of confidence. That's what I also like about her now. Because in the gospel fraternity, it's like, oh, yeah, yeah, Christo, na yeah, Christo, na yeah, Christo. But have you seen her lately? She dresses good. She tries as much as possible to speak English. So it means that she has evolved, and I like that. But as I'm talking about humbleness, let's move away from her. It's Sally humble. Ah, I am. Mm. Are you, am I not humble? Uh, not, not, not for no, me. No, 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 no. No, me, I mean, I know you. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I'm but to the audience, no, no. How I'm also okay, so ready, so okay, so to break. Kawajuna, baby. But you, 
Don't you love me because of that? I love you. Uh -huh. Do you understand what I'm saying? I'm, I'm, I always say so I'm, a, I'm the Paul of all, the Paulina of this industry. You know, we need to tell ourselves the truth sometimes. There's a template, and I'm sure that's why a lot of people do not really, you know, like me, is the fact that I always compare. There are some templates out there that is really working. This same template is the one that is pushing Blacko, uh, where he is now. The same template is pushing uh, 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 Dev Jam, what was the guy say? Stone Boy, and it's working. So I'm very humble, though. You, you know me, I'm very humble. I can't even sleep on the floor with you. I'm very, very humble. You see the difference between me and the others? is, the, is my delivery. You understand what I'm saying? Sometimes one needs to be punched in order to get it. You understand what I'm saying? So me, that's me. And me from where I come from, we don't shield any single. We don't cover anything with anything. My mom or my family really encouraged me to speak, to speak my mind. I don't come from a family where when you are speaking, they will tell you, say, oh, keep quiet. No. They want to listen to what you have in your mind so that if there's a correction, I would you correct it. Do you want me to 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 to, to start covering things a little? The old person, I always say, say we be, we be any day. Mm -hmm. we free so, we so for us, it's not against the rules of the land. Exactly. I have to be uh, mm -hmm. not against the religion. Mm -hmm. good to go. All right. So mm -hmm. thank you. And this is our first acoustic film money press. No be post here. Salimens, how does that increase your electricity bill or for a two? Now I power FM. Now blasting left, right, and center. Why are you there? Oh my God! I knew you would come to that. I come from a very religious background, and I don't know if you're a Christian, but my Bible that I read tells me that if I do something for some people, right shouldn't see the left one. So I also see parents as very much important aspect of our lives. Because if your, your parents did not birth you, right, you wouldn't have become Zion Felix. So to me, and that's what I said on the, to me, I don't think it's sensible, not just you, for anybody to do something for their parents and then come online to just display it. However, this is what I said. Your parent could have called anybody to tell the person, oh, look at what my son has done for me. Do you get? To me, that is more honorable than you. Listen, me, you doing it for other people. People that you work with, they want to show what they have. I don't think that you should show your parents. Yes, you live in a world where you blog, your, but listen, there are certain things that you should be able to cover it. And one of them is, are your parents? That's my opinion. Do you understand what I'm saying? And then we live in an industry where people can share their opinions. I feel it's not wise for anybody to do that. Because listen, according to the Bible, parents are supposed to look for properties for their kids. Like, do you get what I'm saying? To, to set the way out for them, to build for them, for, to look uh, for, for food, for shelter, for whatever for them as, as, as their parents. It is their responsibility. However, it is not every parent that can do that. So the fact that you come from a certain background, that your parents that were supposed to have built a house for you, to have given you something, were not able to give you, and the fact that you have been able to do, does not mean that you have to really come on the internet and just display what I've done this. And me, my issue with you wasn't about the building. You built, you showed. My issue with you was the extensive interview. That to me was selling. No, no, no. You were no, no, no. I, I think it was it was too much. Showing their people show. All over the world, people build houses, give their mothers money and things, and show. But the the extension of calling them Papa, who bought you that, uh, who the house, who got it. So my son Zion Felix bought the land for me. I thought it was so needless, unnecessary. Interview others. Don't interview your parents for anything. Why should we interview others, but not the story of our parents for people to also? like know and learn something from it you you interviewing your parents to tell us about their life story it's not a problem for me but i saw some ridicule in what you did 
that's how I saw it. Because you are ridiculing, you are ridiculing them in a, in a sense that they don't have and the son you've gotten and you are giving them. And so what? And what, what is the ridiculing in the parents not having taking care of you, growing up and giving back to them and letting people know for you to inspire others to give thanks to God? How do you see that as everything a everything that you did there wasn't godly? I have told you. Yes, Matthew chapter six. P people do go to church no, no, and no, give no, thanks no, to God. No, 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 no. Okay. Matthew chapter six, mm -hmm. verse one to three, mm -hmm. says that when you do something for somebody, you don't need to trumpet it. So all these celebrities that you do things for, or they do things for people that they trumpet it. They are. Not, it's not godly. So don't bring God in this matter at all. Because if it's godly, you will show sh. Mm. Yes. So, say, we could show you now, we could do dance here, and all those ones, then you're ungodly. You see, the difference between what you said and what you did is the fact that the God in private did something for that person. And that person wants to show appreciation. It comes back to what I was trying to let you know is that, I was trying to let you know. Your parents could have called, could have done a video appreciating you. You see the, you see what you said about somebody coming to church to say thank you. When God was doing that, that doing whatever good to that person, God didn't trumpet it. But the person wants to show appreciation to God. That's how I wanted, I wanted it to go. That is more honorable. That is more godly because God loves to be shown appreciation. So if God does something for a person and that person goes to church and tells another person, God didn't trumpet it. It was out of the goodness of God's heart that God did it for her. And the person in turn wants to show appreciation for God, what God has done. It wasn't God that went about, I've done something for her, oh, I've done... No. So that's where I'm coming from. I'm coming from purely Bible principle. Which I'm not here to do a back yeah. and forth with her on that issue. Because in Senator Dawson, uh -huh. I'm even on to because they made me kind of my career. And I, even after I came to talk, I almost said, what's I I didn't see that one. They almost said, I back to Power FM to go and talk uh -huh. about... No, no, no. You said you were coming to teach me sense. When what you did was not sensible. Was sensible? No, it wasn't okay, sensible. Okay, to you. Uh -huh. to you. Uh -huh. That's why I'm saying that you say you are coming to teach me sense. When in actual sense, you are ridiculing your no, parents I mean, you. and not being sensible no, no, with you. Uh -huh. Yes. So behind the who know. Let me move on. Yeah. Do you have any personal issue with Mac Brown? Nana no, no, Mac Brown. Why she has sent you to come and ask me? No, questions. I'm asking you. I don't. Do I have a personal issue with you? No. <laughs> but I talk your matter now. So you know me that I don't have an iota of problem with her. What was there? I don't she's She's not my friend. She's not my family member. She's an industry person, just like you are an industry person. When something happens, you know, you've known me over the years. You know that I'm a very passionate person. And when I speak, and I'm very convinced of my conviction, I'm very passionate about it. It has nothing to do with hatred, problem, Whatever. When I see Nana Mama Grand here, we will talk and we will go. There's no problem. However, I think most of the things that she does is hypocritical. Most of the things that she does is hypocritical. And I'll leave it at that. Why do you say so? That's what I'm saying. That said, most of the things that she does to me is hypocritical. Things like I said, I will leave it at that. Because first of all, I mean, you went to radio. I mean, same part. Minimum contract, I need to power for contract. Ben Amo, must be talk as a. No, because I was there be a honey as a watch five acres, and then you have more airtime. Look at Sasa, oh bra, now coffee, now coda. The following week. No, five acres there. I saw the mere bar form. You have more hundred acres. Uh huh. Then you have more coffee. Ah, also the coffee. Yes, I mean, what it is is that I have my opinion of things and. My opinion are my opinion. I don't care. And listen, I am one person that if anybody shares an opinion of me, I'm not bothered do. No. The way that I'm very opinionated, I accommodate people that are also opinionated. I don't like hypocrisy. You see, when 
I say whatever that you say, I said about you. I mean, that's what makes my heart tick. Is the fact that you saw that, oh, what I said to you, it wasn't okay. Do you get what I'm saying? You came out to say whatever that you feel afterwards. Somebody will see me and be hypocritical about it. I see if nothing happened. I don't like such people. And I think that's how Nanama McBrown is. She's a hypocrite. But have you met her after all your commentaries yes, about her? Now. I've met her. I met her somewhere. And then she was saying, oh, I don't have... And I said, that's what I don't like about you. What type of that I said, right? You should have an opinion of it. Because to you, you think you don't have an issue or whatsoever with me. But when I'm saying something about you, like I said, as it is, I don't mean words. Do you understand? You see the way that you said, oh, do you have a problem with Mark Brown? I've heard that you guys went into a meeting where she was addressing all of you and said, oh, I don't know what I've done to Salio. No. I saw that I wasn't there. No. I, I, you were there. I'm not sure. Okay, I don't remember. Okay, don't worry. I heard it. The people that were in your midst came to ask me. Tell me that oh, she was saying this, da, 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 da. Why has she not called me? Oh, maybe that genuinely she has no problem with you. Ah, so why is she complaining to others? You see the hypocrisy? That's not complaining. Uh, Sip it. Uh, uh, okay, question. Uh, no, sir, I don't have a problem with that. It's, it's, it's not, oh, she's replying. Oh, no, no, sir, no, I'm, I'm talking. Uh, no, wait, wait, wait. You just said it. No, no. I'm she saying to you, Selimi Bao. You just said, say, on the bloggers, she has no question. And they're just bloggers. Like, on the amount of she has. Yes, I mean, journalists and all uh -huh. of that. And I'll say, they yes. ask there. Yes. No, say she has no problem with you. Uh -huh. And I'm saying that probably, genuinely, she has no problem with you. But do I have a problem with her? So why are you saying that she's pretend, like she's a hypocrite, say, or no, as or no problem? I said, I said, don't misconstrue me. I said to her, I don't have any problem with her. But I think she's hypocritical. That's what I because said. Because what can now show or no No, 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 no. That's not what I said. I Why? No, I said to you. I will leave it at that. Okay. I won't, I won't, I won't. Maybe I have more things to say, but I don't want to share them now. I don't know can was my own tool, but I said, I don't do it. I don't know what I said. Do you always have to be aggressive? I am, I am aggressive, right? When talking. Really? Yeah. I love that. That makes the difference. Do you think if I come to sit, oh, Zion Fellas, oh, no, it will be so ordinary. I'm not an ordinary person. After you, like, my mom, after you said all those things, in fact, people were writing a lot of things. So, uh, I don't know whether it's true or not. And me, it's out of my family home. I'm so on way here. And I know what I do those things and find my home. So don't ask me. If you know they are don't ask no, me. No, I want I want the minimum. No, 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 no. Don't ask me. No, it doesn't matter. Okay. It doesn't matter whether I've, I have I have kids. <laughs> I, don't, yeah, I know you have kids. I don't have, I don't have kids. It's none of their business. And I wish they would take time to come and find me. I know the beautiful kids that I have. What? I don't show my kids because they are not in the industry. It's not, that's not their business. My kids, my family, are, it's my family. My kids are my kids. They are not for them. Whoever that they are following, did the person give a natural birth? Ah, Whoever. You? It's okay. Me uncle, okay. No, me uncle. Me, 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 me. Because why are you no, talking about who they, they are following? No, but I don't care. I'm just saying, so whoever that you are following, the way that God was able to prepare me and let me have a baby on my own. I said, I'll call 100 acre platform. I said, I'll call my platform. I'll allow it. Sally? Yes, darling. You said you were traveling. Yes, remember. Yes, remember. But you told me, say you were traveling when you come back. But I said, I'll call you. Cobra. Of an hour to two of us. Two of us. Many fans. Because all on Bobo. Of an hour to one more hate you. And what it says is that those who hate me, I'm not really bothered by them. Because Jesus Christ was even hated. Who am I? Who am I? Who am I? You, you are hated. Who are you? The Christ was even hated. So I don't, I don't care. And also, Whatever that I do in this industry, I don't do it for clicks. Have they seen me on social media before? Has, have you seen me on social media or anywhere before? No, I say it and go my What do you do? Yeah, no, I'm not asking for myself. I'm asking for the people. 
What do I do? Yes. I do business. What business? I do business. What business do you do? Why do I have to tell you my business? You're not telling me, you're telling them because the no, no, no. people will sort you anyhow. It, it doesn't matter. But look at me. When you see me, look at my skin. Look at everything about me. Do I look at it? No. So it means I have, I have things going for me. It's their business. They should go and look through it and find out what, what I do. What you are saying? Uh -huh. But you know, sir, I'm not broke, sir. Oh, uh -huh. I know you're a rich man now. Yes. I can't follow now. Ah, but you, you are rich on your own side now. Yeah, but one more. No, 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 no. I'm not, I'm not be one more. We are, we are co I want to do my sugar for me. Me. So I get more money. So that, Oscar. No, that's what you do, eh? Ah. They say that's what you do. You sleep with women for me. I mean, that's what I'm saying. That. Thank you very much. All right, bye bye. Yeah, my name is Sally. Yeah, Sally, the crazy one. Say it. Yeah. Say it. Sally, the crazy one. Uh -huh. Sally, the hypocrite. Ah, uh, yes. Sally, the loud mouth. Yes. Parrot mouth. Yes. Bye bye. Bye bye.